it is essential to keep medical activities ongoing because MSF clinic is still working and hopefully will still work with the most vulnerable one and we're talking about children we're talking about pregnant women the medical care cannot be undermined today only because there's no specific plan from uh, the government only because Europe is still turning a blind eye uh, on these people for us it's important to first of all keep sensitizing the community uh, for the main preventive measures unfortunately in Moria the preventive measures sounds to these uh, people uh, as a joke because uh, how can you ask someone living in a tent to go back and isolate in, uh, in the, his room. How can you ask to avoid social contact for people that are queuing in such a small areas for the food, for the toilet? How can you ask uh, a children or a, a woman to increase their level of hygiene if there's no even uh, enough toilet and shower and water point in the camp? So all of these measures for Moria, they don't apply. Today for COVID, uh, the population at risk are definitely the elderly. Adults with uh, uh, chronic pathologies that they will uh, expose them to uh, a potential infection. Uh, children with uh, uh, chronic pathologies as well.